this is us. We're getting ready to head out to Woodland, Washington to our motel. This is the very beginning of our grand adventure here as we are going to go climb Mount St. Helens this weekend. Getting up at Odark 30 tomorrow, heading up the mountain. This is the beginning. How this is our drive? driveway. About six and a half hours from here to our hotel. And here's Shanoa taking like all right kinds here. of selfies. I'm Snapchatting. I am Snapchatting. Oh, she's Snapchatting. That's what they call it. Here we go. Columbia River, Mount Hood in the distance. Shanoa listening to her song she sang when she got her boutique pulled out. I've been chilling through the ride. I've been living a lonely life. back we had our uh, luxurious accommodations here it is the uh, motel de six okay it's motel six but hey man it was only 50 the highlighted ground oh here we go leaving the drive point four hotel then turn lamb chan showed up eventually but I guess showing up's pretty good there's Chanel Bowen back seat same crew that we packed along for the Mount Spokane Adventure. Miles. Then turn right on East yeah. Scott Avenue. Here we go. Continue See you guys uh, later. Then turn left on here we go. Starting to climb up an elevation here. Go to the woods. Just picked up our climbing permits in Cougar Worship. There it is. That's her. Yeah. Mount St. Helens. We're doing this. <laughs> it's exciting. All right. Just got the climbers bivouac. There's snow on my phone. Lamb Chan. There she is. There's Mount St. Helens. A little bit chilly right here right now. Be a little bit more chilly up there. Yep, since 1980. Always wanted to come up here. Now we're here. Alright guys. This is it. In the immortal words of the late great volcanologist David Johnston. Vancouver, Vancouver. This is it. That's our destination at the top of that bad boy right there. Or bad girl, I should say. This is Mount St. Helens. There's a woman volcano right here. Woman volcano? Yeah, this is her, his, her, her majestic beauty right here. Boom. There it is, trail, trail head. <laughs> and just so everyone knows, <laughs> Lam Chan went to REI and he bought the expensive poles because the previous cheap poles he bought broke. Well, one of his broke. One of the expensive <laughs> poles broke. Chanel and I, we're walking with two sets of ski poles. Ski poles. That I paid a total of $7 for. Ski poles. I think he paid like 50 bucks for each one of those darn things. Yeah, <laughs> ski poles from, from the Union Gospel Mission. All right, and away up we go. And here's Chanel and Lamb arguing. On the way through here, I think the one thing we forgot was bug spray. That might come back to bite us in the ass. Get it? Bite us in the ass. Because we forgot bug spray. Get it? It's a joke. It has two meanings. A literal and a figurative meaning. And that's why it's funny. Okay, we're on our way. See you guys a little bit later on. Peace. Ooh. We're still in the woods. And... Chinoa is pushing our pace for us right now. Look at that. She's down in front. I'm bringing up the rear end right now. There's Chanel Bowen. Lamb Chan's up there a little bit. He's in really good shape again. Look at those boulders. Look at those. It's impressive. Imagine grabbing one of these and throwing them in your sweat. <laughs> yeah. Just had to get a video shot of here. Nice pretty picture. We're getting up there guys. Upward and home. here we are. First official break. 
as we climb up the mountain. We're almost out of the tree line here. All right, here we are. We are for the most part tree lining it right now. Boom, look at that. We scrambling up right there. There's the rock scramble. This is where it's gonna start getting a little bit rough right here. Got the nut up, hit it. We're approaching the, we're approaching the Mallory's, our, uh, what's his name, uh, the Hillary Step. And after that, we'll be going over, going through the bottleneck. Hey, just kidding. <laughs> the Hillary Step and bottleneck, get it? If you're a mountaineer, you understand that. All right, here we are. We're on the first part of the rock scramble. That's where we broke at. Mount Adams in the distance. Mount Hood in the distance. There's some guys down there on the snow, taking a snowy route. How's it going, guys? Pretty good. How you doing? All right. All right. <laughs> More people yeah. coming behind us. Gentleman from Texas, right here. Yeah, good stuff. Meeting all kinds of people up here. This is actually kind of neat to find out where was from. Yeah. Ooh, well, here we are taking a break. There they are. Super troopers. We're doing it, we're doing it well. They're definitely on the slopes of one mount. St. Helens, fellow climber, right there. We're we're halfway there. Halfway there. <laughs> Hopefully more than that, but yeah, yeah, we don't want to be over that. Yeah, yeah. We're high up though. We're above trees. Yeah. We're above trees. I think so. But here we are, another break. There he is. Which one do you think is harder? Snow Bowen. That one. I'm Chan. Yeah. This is uh, out of all the mountains. This is the easiest. Hmm. Oh, there I am. Look at that. Selfie. We're in a tank top now. Probably gonna burn up pretty good. Look at that. Ow. Yeah. That's why you put sunscreen on. I have sunscreen on. <laughs> put more on. Who are you calling a moron? So we're gonna come flying down that? I will see. Good. I haven't seen anybody doing it. Yet. Nope. I'm kind of nope. scared. That looks kind of scary. To me, yeah, it's the top what right are there. Option? Like this? This is hard. I know. That's hard coming down. I don't know. Slide break. down is faster. I feel like either I'm going to break my face. <laughs> There's lamb. Baby, we can go Small. nowhere hmm. but up from here. Boom. My dear. Okay, we should get going. Guys. Wait for me. Let me get a drink. I'm ready to suck along. I'm a shot. We're uh, about almost 7,000 feet. Here we are. There's Shanua. There's Lamb. Mountain Lamb. And there it is. You can actually see people up there. That'll be us in a little bit. Booyah. Oh, break time. We are officially on the hardest part of the climb. And we're feeling it. Yep. That rock field was real long and it was difficult. But this is harder. This is really steep, straight up. And the sand is just fun as heck to walk in. Well, actually, it's more like oh. right here. Well, Chanoa and Lamb have hit it. That's them at the top. And I am uh, falling behind. So I guess I'll uh, video document here with the Tennessee volunteer guy. <laughs> right on. Yeah. Top of the hill I go. <sighs> I believe those flaggings are marking the, it's called the ice cornices means edge, edge of the crater, right here, this is it, I step out there, I'm standing, oh my goodness, oh wow, that's Mount Rainier in the distance there, there's Adams, Hood, yeah there's Hood, it's kind of blurry now, aren't it? Washington way back there. Yeah. Oh my God. Look at this. this is just beautiful up here. I'm gonna get a little bit higher up here. Rainier, there it is. 
second, or no, first highest in the That's Cascades. Yeah. yeah, it's a high mountain. It's amazing. Yeah, I'm gonna go join the rest of my crew. They're up a little bit higher up, we'll have a better view. Over there is the crater rim on the other side. Going that way is Johnston Ridge. Uh, over that way also would be Windy Ridge. Good stuff. And there's Chan, Lamb Chan. Of course, he brought his uh, Chinese. Chinese flag up here. He's trying to claim it for Mother China. Mother China. I'm up here claiming it for the Nimi Pu Nation. Gee, yeah. Wow, all that. That's all Crater Rim. It's all Crater Rim. That's what it looks like from this side, all you people out there. Spirit Lake. So it's still choked with logs from the 1980 eruption. It's raining near in the distance, of course. Due to the snow cornice, however, we can't, uh, or cornice, or however you say that word, we can't. We don't have a very good view of. Uh, what is this? Those are cookies. Those are cookies. We don't have a very good shot of the dome or the well back in there. Those are, those are lemon cookies. The crater rim, man. Back in 1980, uh, this place was 13 feet higher than what we are right now. It was 9,600 feet up in uh, 1980, May 18th, 832. The top of this mountain blew out laterally that way, straight across. And uh, I think over that way is that Johnston Ridge, five miles away. Um, he died in the blast while he was monitoring the mountain. And um, that was also Spirit Lake. That's where. Harry Truman, of course, had his uh, lodge and died there too. Spirit Lake is, I think I heard, like 100 feet higher than what it was before. Yeah. Someone went and put some fish in there, so there's actually fish in that lake now. Wow, it's just amazing. It's like one of the coolest things I've ever seen. I'm gonna just do a little bit of a turn here. Wow, man. Here we are, we stand atop. We have made it. Now we're gonna kick back, relax, eat some food, have some drink, make our way back down. That is amazing. We did it! Yay! Yay! We did it! Look! Look at what we did! Yay! Look at what we did! Yay! We did it! Look at what we did! That kid could be a great crossfit Ooh, now we're closer. Oh my gosh, there's the inside of an active volcano, guys. Holy buckets. This is nuts. Looks like the whale back is gone already. Well, you can see steam down there. Lava dome's rebuilding itself. About, about another hundred years. This crate will be gone, I bet. This crate will be filled back in within about a hundred years. Another 200 more years, 250. Like be back up to its regular height of 1,300. Right yeah. 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 Crazy. Yeah, yeah, or something. If you're higher up, than you're. Wow. This is just incredible. Yeah, it's just so Yeah, it is actually. Different colors. Well, they actually, if you go down and hike the Hummocks Trail, there's a little sign that talks about a guy has gone through all the pumice plain down there and everything and figured out what parts of the mountain the various pumice plain came from. Because it actually Holy erupted cow. and collapsed in like three sections. <laughs> so he figured out okay, this part. Oh, there's days when you're just so happy to see trees. Here we are, descending St. Helens. It's pretty damn late. We had some issues coming down. It got a little bit intense. Yep, I'll save that for another time. Hit me up if you want to know. But I still recommend this for anybody. And it was a great learning experience. But yeah, we're almost down. Right down there is the uh, regular trail. There's the tree line. We'll be joining back up to the tree line. Then from there, it's just straight, good, old-fashioned trail for two miles back to the vehicles. That's it. See you at the parking lot. Peace. Whew. See that mountain up there? Earlier today, we were up there. That is the crater rim for Mount St. Helens. We all made it. We all made it back down. Yeah, we're all tired. We're all ready to go. You don't put 
put the camera on it. Oh, okay. My bad. <laughs> Here we are. There's Shanoa. Here's Mr. Lamb Chan. How do you feel, Lamb? Exhausted, quite Exhausted. honestly. Uh, glad I'm alive. Yeah. And Randy Bowen is probably the best climber out there today out of the three of us. You know, yeah, it was. Yeah, I, I heard that from a few other people, you know. Just rumors, rumors. It's good. <laughs> What do you think, Shanoa? How you feeling, baby girl? Me and Lam almost died twice. Are you dead? No. Okay. <laughs> but it was fun. It was I fun. It. Oops, I'm too close to my face. My grill. Gee, yeah. Made it back. I'm tired as hell. Gonna go back to Woodland, reevaluate my situation, figure out what I'm gonna do tonight. Deuces! Well, here we are. Final approach to the house. Adventure completed. We done. Made it to the rim of Mount St. Helens. And now we're sore. Now we are sore. And tired. We're hurt. We're tired. Yeah. Can't wait to sleep in my own bed. Yeehaw. Peace out, yo. Thanks for watching. Till next time. Yep. <laughs>